I'm Justin Houston. If you want help with Spanish grammar, this is for you. After the three minutes or less video, you can practice what you've learned. My belief is I can do all things, including Spanish. If you believe the same, let's get started. We conjugate verbs for two main reasons. To figure out who and when. If you start with an infinitive verb, you already know what. For example, cocinar means to cook. But it doesn't tell us who cooks or when cooking occurs. For that reason, we conjugate, meaning we remove the AR, ER, or IR ending and add the who or when. The song teaches us all the steps. Drop the AR leaf. We do that by circling AR. AR is the leaf. And what happens to leaves in the fall? They fall. What you're left with is the stem, C O C I N, which is cook. Next, put the stem in every box. A everywhere, but an O at the top. S on the middle left, N on the bottom right. It's a peaceful night, so the ammo's on ice. Be sure to add the accent mark over the A of ice in box number five. Remembering your box numbers when you learned pronouns. Box number one, cocino means I cook. Box number two, cocinas means you cook. Box number three, cocina means he cooks, she cooks, or you cook if it's formal. Box number four, cocinamos means we cook. Box number five, Cocinais means y'all cook. Box number six, cocinan means they cook, or you cook, plural. Notice something else. You can say I cook by saying yo cocino or simply cocino. Both are correct. These conjugations that we're starting with are present tense, meaning it's happening right now. 